Yeah, I, I think it was more nervous just to get to the next level. Yeah, yeah. 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 I fidgeted with every single thing. Why? Why did I think that I was If somebody's got a handful of seeds in their hands, they might be willing to trade what they have for something you have. So just, it's really a free-for-all type event where you just kind of do what you feel happy with. Just sell the if you want to use a little envelope okay. to put them in, and there's a pen. How's the swap going? It's five. Hold it together. It's five. <laughs> Uh, no, I, um, somebody posted in one of the You're just holding groups. someone else's loofah? No, oh, I bought it. It's mine now. I didn't grow it. Somebody posted in one of the um, groups saying they were trying to get gas money together. Yeah. And that they would sell loofahs for $5. And I was like, I will totally help you get your gas money. I'll get a loofah. This is so cool. It's worth the seat alone. Yeah. It is. I'll buy your loofah. <laughs> Test before you jump, okay? Um, test before you jump. We, again, we, we, we get starry-eyed too fast and we don't realize that success is incremental and not spontaneous. Farmer's Market needs to be on the parking lot of Walmart, okay? And if Walmart won't let it be there, there should be a, a, a citywide campaign to shame Walmart into letting it be there. I mean, they talk about being locally uh, interested and community-minded to get their check of their, you know, $6,700 that they gave to United Way. Well, let's see how community-minded you are and let farmers sell their stuff right on your parking lot. How about that? Okay? So, anyway. But I'll conclude with this idea, and that is, if you're going to take your homestead and you're going to move it into a place that is going to replace your off-farm income, and you actually want to have a business and you want to do that, 
you've got to have a mission statement. You got to know where you're going. If you don't know where you're going, you'll never get there. Hey. Hey. You surviving? Hey. Uh, Did he give you that? Yeah, I wish. Oh, did you buy it from me? <laughs> of yeah. course. Yeah, I really like it. I know. Is that the plate on Damascus? This one? <laughs> yes. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I love it. What did he call it? It's pattern welded Damascus. Mosaic. Mosaic. Explosion. Wow. Mosaic explosion. That's yeah. Explosion. That is also it's, it's he made like 30 hours. Oh yeah. Just yeah. for the blade. Yeah. You know what's, what's funny about a billet like that? It. Like, see how small that is? He probably started with a chunk of metal about that. Yeah. Day. Like yeah. Damascus, you lose so much metal. Right. That's crazy. But I got my new mushroom forge. <laughs> <laughs> she said, I'll let you touch it. <laughs> well, I was like, I was like, Ryan, if you really want it, you know, let's let's double check the account and make sure we have it. But right. I think that's worth. It. I think you should do it. And then I'm like, I get to wear it, right? Yeah. <laughs> Split visitation. She's we did not bring <laughs> shy, fancy girl, shady girl, Ruby. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. Thank nope. you. It's just their doppelgangers. Yeah, and that's important.